Moving on is our fifth team for today. That's uh, the deep tech and robotic startup. Please join me on stage. Shen, Shenzhen, Shenyang Guangxue Keji. Please join me on stage. All right, you have three minutes. Jumpstart your dreams now. Uh, hi, everyone. Uh, this is Stanley. Uh, I make a brief uh, introduction about ultra filter lens. Uh, ultra filter lens is the basic core technology in projection and in, in uh, AR, VR devices and in the IoT display. Uh, the value point of our technology is that we can break through the global monolopy of the RICO pattern. Uh, in the last 15 years, no, no one can do that, but we can, we can do that. Uh, this is the, uh, in the last three years, we have attended many competitions. Uh, this is the, the honor uh, we win. Uh, I have engaged in developing projection lands for 15, uh, for over 25 years. Uh, uh, we have developed many state of our products. And this is the uh, status of our company. Uh, I think we have getting the intention order uh, over uh, uh, 200 million RMB. And our purchase lens has passed the task by, by the electronics uh, in Shenzhen. Uh, according to their conclusions that uh, our pattern can make a complete uh, design around the recourse pattern uh, with the same quality as well. And this is the uh, products using by Rico Palin and by our uh, project lens. I think we have very advantage in the size and in the, co in, and in the cost. And the ultra short throw technology can be used in the four category of products. And this is the global projection market size. Uh, in 2022, the global markets has been over 17 million. And the uh, growth rate for the, uh, for the artificial flow of products is over 10%. And this is the global markets for the uh, artificial flow uh, projection lens. Uh, by 2025, the market size will be over uh, 2 billion US dollars. And this is the, the Vision Pro. This is the product launched by Apple. And according to uh, their, um, the, the outer field throw optical module uh, has, is the rank two of the all core structure. And this is the application uh, in the AR HUD. Uh, we have um, cooperated with the uh, Hyundai Mobiles team. And this is the uh, scenario used in IoT display. Time's up to please wrap up in one sentence. OK, and we have uh, many uh, um, uh, cooperation projects with the uh, Hong Kong uh, uh, Technology and University. And we have also have the, the, uh, the cooperation project uh, with the Hong Kong Science a Polytech a Science. Uh, we are going to also to establish the Please Hong wrap Kong up company. in one sentence. Okay. Thank you. And judges? Hello, thanks for the presentation. Uh, in layman's terms, could you explain what technical, uh, how superior technically it is with the incumbent uh, recall? technology that's existing already. Uh, you mean, how do we make a design around, right? Yeah, uh, what, what, uh, in terms of performance and what it enables in terms of uh, end use, why is it uh, a lot more superior than, than what is currently existing already? Actually, uh, we, we have um, many complete different uh, optical um, lens assembly um, uh, about the, the uh, Ricoh. Actually, um, 
also the, the focusing the focusing uh, uh, way is also different. Uh, in in Rico, the focusing way is in the middle group of of, of lens, but by by our technology, the focusing uh, lens in the, the front is in the front group of lens. It's quite different. What implications does it bring? Is it because uh, the, the end use can be more, a lot more compact, um, a lot more smaller in size? And, uh... Yes. By, by using our technology, we can shrink the size of purchase lens and also the cost as well. Because we can get um, the yield rate for our purchase lens is, is, is much better than the Ricoh's structure. One question about the market. How, how big is your revenue? How has been the growth for the last three years? And who are your major customers? OK. Uh, our major customers is also in the, uh, the customers in China, such as uh, Hisense uh, and the, um, the Aptronics. Yep. And, uh, and we have the. Uh, Here's the, our uh, financial forecast in the, in the coming three years. And by uh, next year, I think we will get uh, the revenue will, will be over uh, 10 million US dollars. So, sorry, which, which year is 2023 in this uh, one first, second, three? Oh, for 2023, the, our revenue is about, is about uh, Five million RMB. Yeah, we we just started mass uh, mass production uh, this year, early this year. Yeah. Any other questions by our judges? Uh, all right. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you for your attention. Thank you for your presentation and thank you to all of our judges.